hello guys and welcome back to another episode of the pot spoon kitchen today we will be making a really delicious and flavorful salt fish fritter for this recipe you will need your cleaned cooked and washed salt fish you want to get as much of the salt out as possible I will also add all the ingredients in the description below red bell peppers we have whole milk egg granulated garlic pink Himalayan salt and white pepper onions pimento peppers cilantro baking powder we have our flour green onions and we have our yellow chopped bell peppers we will start by seasoning our salt fish with all our vegetables guys and don't forget if you like this recipe please like share and subscribe to our channel and click the notification bell at the top so that you will get no the notification whenever we post a video And we will now mix this this will be really delicious and really flavorful We will now add our egg. If you try this recipe and you enjoy this recipe, please we encourage you to comment and let me know how let us know how this recipe turned out and if you enjoyed it. We will now add our baking powder. Flour. Thank you. 
because the salt fish already has liquid to it also our egg we may not need to add all the milk so I will adjust the ingredient and I will put it in the description below This should be enough. It smells absolutely delicious. So what we will do now, we will leave this to sit for about 20 minutes and then we will come back and then we will fry this up. So in our frying pan, we have two cups of vegetable oil. You can use whatever oil that you have to fry these up. So we will leave this to heat up and then we will start the frying process. We want to go ahead and test the oil to see if it's hot enough and once this floats to the top we know that it's hot enough so our fritter is now ready to be fried we don't want to make these too big because they will proof up in the oil we just want to put at least one spoon tablespoon and we don't want to overcrowd the pan because the temperature of the oil will drop I will put four of these at a time We want to get these nice and golden brown. From these. And they look absolutely festive. It is important that we know that we eat with our eyes first. So in another 15 seconds, we will turn this over so that the other side can cook. nice and golden brown we want to ensure that these cook on the inside We will turn this over again. To ensure that they are cooked evenly.
so guys here you have it our delicious salt fish fritters and we are serving this up with a tamarind sauce for the recipe for the tamarind sauce you can find this in the description below I will add a link so let's try one of these these smells so so delicious and they are really really light so let's try and see what it looks like on the inside you can see the salt fish pulling apart and we are going to try this with our tamarind sauce mmm mmm this is so good mmm